Hey guys, Dabu7. I just want to bring some attention to the reality of a few things Obama can do here to try to cement his legacy into position. Now, what he's been doing is serving up a series of executive orders time after time after time. He recently, he has put out several that has some people you know, scratching their head wondering exactly what he's up to. Well, he can continue this here, and what he can also do is when it comes to energy and things like that, he can try to put things into place and try to make it very hard for the incoming president to try to undo anything that, that he does here. Now, we've seen thus far, time and time again, Obama slip these executive orders out. He recently... He put one out in regards to space weather that ordered these different agencies to come together and to make a device that would emulate a solar flare, basically an EMP, which they already have EMP devices. All you have to do is explode a nuke 200 miles above the surface of an area, and you're going to wipe out a lot of the electronics below, and that, that wave can penetrate in some instances down to 12 feet deep now he said that he wanted them to get this back to him within six months well obviously we will have a new president in office when that comes around and what he also just did is he this emergency we're we're in this state of emergency if people don't know that right now because of the proliferation of nuclear weapons biological weapons uh wmds all the way around and I believe it was Clinton that put it into place to begin with, saying that we are in this constant, constant state of emergency. And Obama just continued that on Election Day while no one was paying attention. And he can make moves like this. He can make some controversial moves at this point. What's, what's it going to matter is kind of how he's viewing it because – they can try to cement some things and try to put things in writing that may take at least four years to undo. So at this point, the Democrats at this that are looking at a Republican Trump, a Republican House, and a Republican Senate that all just won and he could try to make he could do some interesting things here on his way out bottom line so there's some uh some other points they touch on here in this article i just uh wanted to shed some light on it and about to drop some videos here showing that his old buddy hillary george soros and all these guys are up to the same old tactics you guys seen the mass protests across the country last night yeah, there was lots of people. Not all of them were paid, but yeah, some of them were. And we're going to expose that to Craigslist ads, the organizations, and it all leads back to the money of George Soros and these same minions, billionaires that have been backing the guys in this party. So keep your eyes peeled for videos on that. Also, make sure to check out our recent sponsor here, the Essential Drugstore. For any of you guys looking to stock up on medicine out there, antibiotics, heart medicine, insulin for the diabetics out there, chose to go with these guys because they serve as an avenue for people to go down and stock up on these things. I'll leave a link for all this in the description below. And if you guys need to get anything to me, hit me up, dabu7 at yahoo.com. Much love, y'all.